Hello. Two rooms, please. Oh, uh, I'm sorry. We've only got one. One. Well, uh, what with the hoedown yesterday and people in town for the holidays? We'll take it. We will take it. Okay, uh, it's number seven. Last room on the left. Thanks. Enjoy your stay. Thank you. Oh, there it is. I'm oh. there. Sorry about that. So, um, did Luke happen to say where he was going? Whether or not he might return? No, I'm sorry. Uh, he paid the bill, and I turned away to get his receipt, and when I turned back, he was just gone. Unbelievable. You know, you planned this whole thing, you know? And pretty elaborate to convince me that we belong together, and it works, you know? It gets me right to the edge, and I guess because I didn't just fall immediately into his arms, he ran away without a backward glance. I'm, I'm sorry things didn't work out. Yeah, <laughs> some things aren't meant to. Oh, you don't really believe that. I mean, not after everything I've heard about the famous Luke and Laura. I wouldn't exactly say famous. <laughs> oh, no, my aunt and uncle have been telling me stories about you for years. Your aunt and uncle? Are, are you a Whitaker? Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm Kate. I'm their niece. Really? Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Your aunt and uncle are just such wonderful people. They have been so good to Luke and me over the years. Oh, yeah, well, they have some pretty amazing stories about the two of you. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> well, especially the first time that you were ever here. Oh. oh. How romantic it all seemed and how much in love the two of you were. So when your husband called, I mean, when um, Luke called to book a room, I was happy to help. Thanks. Um, I just, I never pictured you two apart. Um, in my mind, it all sounded so wonderful. Um, what you had, so, well, once in a lifetime. Well, uh, good night. Good luck. Uh, yeah, good night. Good luck to you, too.